What's up guys, what's going on? Camp out coming at you with a sneaker review. I was unlucky, uh, unlike a lot of people who got through, but Nike this morning or at like one o'clock, they dropped them again. Uh, they dropped them as a restock Thursday when they did initially release them. I didn't get through on any of the accounts. Uh, except for the first attempt and my PayPal didn't go through. So either way, I was getting shafted on this deal, but let's get right into it. This is a size 10. Let me close it back up and show you guys the other side. I'll turn it this way. Size 10, the box is pretty dope right off the bat. Air Max 98 Supreme. You got sail, white, reflective, silver, white, whatever. Anyway, size 10. Thank you, it's the kid for coming through to drop these off so I can do a review. Maybe he'll be nice enough to put them on so you can see them on feet as well. Uh -uh -uh. Just saying. He's sitting behind me, but he's very quiet. Anyway, paper, whatever, slide box, slide top. I really don't care about that. I care more about the shoes, so we're gonna take them right out, and then we're gonna get into a review. Initially, I was taken back, because unlike the pictures in person, they are very, very, very clean. Super fucking dope. I kind of want snakeskin now, not gonna lie to you. The material is on point. I thought it was like this mesh overlay, uh, that made it look like it was snakeskin, but this is very, very clean. It's very, I don't know, I, I can't even explain it. It feels like they took snakeskin and put it on the shoe. Exactly what it feels like. So quality is definitely 100% on point. The aesthetics are very clean. The silhouette's dope. I like 98s. A lot of people don't like 98s. I don't know why. Uh, probably because I'm a little bit older. It's definitely in my wheelhouse of sneakers that I collected when I was younger, but regardless, this shoe is very fucking dope. And I didn't like snakeskin, it was probably my least favorite colorway, and it just jumped up to being my favorite colorway, just because of the material. So if you were lucky enough to get snakeskin, kudos, good call. Uh, a lot of people, I think, slept on the snakeskin colorway, like myself, up until about 10 minutes ago when I looked at them. And uh, let's get into it. So lateral side, you have two different portions. You have the lower portion on the lateral side before you get to the midsole, all snakeskin. Uh, I guess like a mid-sized Nike swoosh there. It, it, it's clean. You have this rib mid portion on the lateral side. It's double layered, so you have an upper and lower portion, as you can see. I'll take some pictures so you get a little bit more detail. You can see the shimmer of the snakeskin on there as well, which is very, very dope. Uh, sliding around to the heel counter before I get to the upper portion of the lateral side, you have the world for world famous. Uh, not too crazy. If you've seen a 98 before, you already know what the shoe looks like, but I believe this tubing is all 3M. I will get you a picture so you can see what it looks like. Uh, you got the pull tab with uh, 3M Supreme on there as well. Air Max in the air bubble like you would get from a 98 as normal. Sliding around to the medial side, you have a higher portion or the, um, the, the nylon upper area, which takes over more of the shoe on like the lateral side, so it's not identical or symmetrical, but that's a 98, so if you're unfamiliar, that's what you're looking at. Uh, center portion on the midside, you have a little hit of the snakeskin, and again, you have that tubing for the 3M all the way across. No aglets on these except for the upper portion, or grommets, I should say. This is all 3M in the grommet area for the upper portion, so one, two, three holes, and then you have just the nylon straps with 3M down them as well. Uh, the, the shoe is clean. It's, it's very clean. Just looking over it because I haven't really looked at it in detail till about right now. So I'm breaking down the shoe as I'm talking to you. But everything about it is very, very clean. I like it a lot. I fucking I'm just stare at it for a little while. Jump into the toe box area. You got Supreme on the upper portion of the toe box. Toe capping is obviously Python. Python hit with the Supreme underneath it. Great laces inside. They did come with extra laces. I'll show you those on the other shoe. You see your two nylon slits or holes for your lacing area. Three gray on the bottom. If you've had a 98 before, you know exactly what you're looking at. This is nothing new. Air Max in the black, gray, white, and red. It's pretty dope. Also on the underlay of that is the Python again. Very, very clean. The 98 is very comfortable, by the way. So don't ever think that you're not getting a comfortable shoe. You're getting a collaboration and comfort. So that's dope. Uh, footbed, you have that stamping like always when you get Supreme times anything. Supreme times Nike on this case or in this case. And uh, yeah, I think that's pretty much going to do it for the review. I'm going to take some pictures of the shoes. I'll show you the extras in the other shoe. Tacked on there, you got your little white laces, which uh, probably either one could work just fine. I'm not gonna swap them out because it's not my pair, like I said, but like I uh, hopefully get my friend in the background here to try them on so we get a little on foot action, would be nice. Anyway, both shoes are mirrored. We'll hit the outsole on this shoe. All gray, Nike swoosh, mid portion, air bubble on the midsole. Everything about it is, uh, is very, 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 very dope. Very fucking dope. I'm very jealous right now, not gonna lie. This is one of those fucking shoes that I should have not slept on. Anyway, all right guys, hope you enjoyed. Peace, don't forget my thumbs up and subscribe.